Hey Mech Warriors, Jonathan here at Night Knowledge. Welcome to another episode of my Mech Warrior 5 series. Uh, it's not co-op today, still single player. Uh, I've been playing it a lot, a lot, uh, and, and totally loving everything about it. So uh, a lot of time has passed since we last played. Uh, the biggest news is, as you can see, we have a ton more mechs. I had uh, these two rows. The top two rows were my first, I guess, uh, two lances. And then I got tired of seeing the same javelins, panthers, fire starters, locust fleas in the uh, mech markets. So I, f so I actually um, flew all the way... So see, I was initially, you start off in this zone right here, the backwater region, and then I was doing a lot of quests in the Torian uh, corridor, but I wanted, I like, I was, I was getting tired of the, the same mechs over and over, and these were the two industrial hubs uh, that you start off with, uh, and technically a third over here, just, just, just so you know. And... I could not tell, like, like I kept going to these industrial hubs and I couldn't get any different mechs. They're all the same. So I'm like, okay, I don't know. I, I forget or I don't know what mechs are based off. Is it where you're located at or your mercenary level? I wasn't sure. So I blindly flew north. And I eventually found this little uh, industrial sector right here. It doesn't, like, you actually have to fly into the zone to like discover these new these new areas so i went to like uh kurrigan and kashila and i was able to find uh a champion uh the champion which is actually one of the new uh heavy is actually considered a heavy mech from the dlc i got the dervish coincidentally uh another medium mech that is uh from the dlc and finally, I got a crab. And um, so, so much heavier mech. So actually, technically, yeah, crab, 50, 55, and 60. And I, unknowingly, I, I didn't uh, make my dervish correct. Like, the dervish is surprisingly very much like a Kintaro. So in terms of that, it's heavy on the missiles. And I built this guy totally wrong not knowing what the dervish really is but i will be coming out with a video that go that goes over all the new mechs in the dlc very shortly so uh so that's something that's new uh something else that's new once you hit level f four in terms of your mercenary rank you'll get the ability to go to what's called cantinas uh that's what's also new from the dlc uh these symbols here uh this green symbol here says a canteen is available you go there and it will have three quests that you can pick up and um uh there's many different types of types of uh jobs so equipment collector mech collector mech hunter blah 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 and basically when you complete this quest so let's take a look at objective log this one here says Go to the Torian corridor and collect one aggro mech control computer. So there will be a symbol on um, on the star map. Let me show you. Can we get a little closer or are we too far away? We might be too far away right now. Yeah, we're too far away. But there would be a, a, a sim like you know how it shows the symbol of the missions? It would also have a green symbol. Uh, not not the cantina symbol, but it have a symbol showing you that the thing you're looking for is there. And when you complete it, you get some sea bills, you get some reputation, you get some gear, uh, you get some um, some experience for that that specific uh, branch. And you start off on the left, and and it starts unlocking. Each level will unlock something for you. So as you can see here, for the mech collector, it'll uh, you can install this and upgrade it to your battle mech. So I'll, I'll quickly show you that as well. Uh, as you can see here, two upgrades. This is something new. You can take the upgrades that, that you've learned and apply it, drag it to your mech. And looks like each mech could possibly have up to eight upgrades. And uh, they're not free though. As you can see, it, it takes up a slot. So I guess some might take more slots. And uh, there's a specific C bill cost. It, 325 is not too bad at this point because you can see I got 26 million. It takes some days to also refit and it's per mech. So different mechs can have different upgrades. Uh, so it's all going to cost, it's, it's more of a money sink for you. And as you can see, 
the the bonuses uh, are not are, are good but they're not like overpowered five percent seven point five percent five percent five percent seven point five so it's nothing crazy um so that's something new the cantinas so as you can see my jobs are kill three locusts panthers javelins commandos because i feel like these are easier ones there are some that has you kill um uh helicopters and tanks i don't feel like those trigger correctly or maybe i don't know the specific ones to, to take out so uh let's get right into it i'm actually right i'll show you where i am right now i'm right here in the i've moved to the cn commonality so initially i was remember in the backwater a one to two area and this was a two to four area i grinded a lot in the one to two and two to four and I figure now that I got these new mechs, maybe I can try the the harder ones. So we have a war zone contract and an assassination contract. And a, just a quick look for you guys. Um, I'll show you my my status with all the great houses. So House Davian hates me, uh, as does House Merrick. House Liao loves me, uh, and because I do a lot of those cantina quests. The outlaws love me, but I imagine one day they're going to hate me too. <laughs> so uh, back to the game, back to the game. Contract. So I have a contract from <coughs> House Merrick and one from Davian. I'm going to go with uh, House Merrick one. I only got three negotiation points. Technically, I got six, but uh, minus three due to them being hostile. So I'm going to try this. I'm going to... See, 12 salvage shares is actually not very much. I'm, that just means it's going to be a light mech. And at this point, I don't need light mechs anymore. I'm going to do a little bit of damage coverage and assassination. So I'll just put, put money right now. Although, one salvage share could mean I get some better gear, but I'll, I'll stick with that. Okay, you'll also notice I have some better uh, lance mates as well. I, I was looking for lance mates with, with higher overall uh, or total skills and ones with high of the shield and high of the um, avoiding damage. I've been using the black blackjack a lot. Uh, as you can see, it's equipped with chem lasers and short burst weapons or short burst lasers. Um, the chem lasers, what is special about it is that it'll do less damage but also a lot less heat. The drawback with the chem laser though is that it does require ammo for a laser, but um, it, it it gives you a lot of ammo, uh, and and I've been I have a smattering of guys. So, but I'm gonna try some of my new guy my new max that I picked up. So I'm gonna be using my heavy champion. Uh, let's see, and I love I love the new light, medium, and heavy rifles. They they're kind of like lo um, modified uh, versions of the AC guns. So. Uh, the heavy rifle is like h almost half the weight of an AC-20 and only does like two damage less than it. And but the range is much is, is like three times three times longer. So the the drawback with rifles is that it um, think of it like the the old timey muskets. They take a super long time to to reload. So whereas I can shoot maybe two to three times with an AC-20, I'd only be able to shoot once with the heavy rifle. So, so, so it's all balanced. It's not overpowered in, in any way. Oh, hmm. So the question is, do I bring? I think I'll, I think I'll keep this team. So I have the champion, and uh, let's see. Can I switch with some? My crab. That's fifty tons. That's too heavy. Okay, so I'll just stick with this, this team. As you can see, also I sp tried to spend some time uh, changing the color around, but. Um, is only payable if we bring the entire group to justice as you can see so you with the, the uh, champion mech is it is well, that's not good before we can back uh, the, the champion mech it has uh, what's it called uh, a harrier jet look to it okay so let me just let me just get my uh, things ready okay there we go so one, two, three, apply. I didn't do that beforehand. Just so, yeah. It looks like a jet with legs. 
So this assassination contract. I'm gonna go near these buildings. See? So um, you saw this in the last video. So you can collect salvage. And uh, j just so you know, I've done testing. You need to be a hundred meters uh, close to a building to be able to to uh, see if there's any salvage. It'll automatically do it for you. You don't have to stand, or you don't have to specifically look at the building. You just have to walk near it a hundred meters. Gotta be careful. I think this is a crevice, right? Can't see. Yep. Okay, that's a mistake. Uh -oh. What do we got? We have a locust. Okay, no problems. Enemy vehicles in sight. Tango eliminated. Oops, I used my heavy rifle. Good. I don't know the, the weapons on. This is the first time I've been using my uh, champion. This guy should be bothering us though. Ooh. Okay, so my my heat is not good. Oh, I missed. There we go. And as you can see, one of my jobs got completed. Or, not completed, it, it, it counted towards it. So I don't have to just be the one getting the kills, my, my lance mate kills will count as well. What's that? There's more salvage. And another thing, uh, uh, you can destroy the building, walk over this, and it it uh, doesn't destroy the salvage. Oops, I keep using the wrong weapon. Here, hold on a second. Let me just change the weapon group. I'm more used to that. Two, three, four. There we go. And uh, you know what? Do that. There we go. Here comes something. There we go. Okay. You know what? Let's head over here since. Looks like we're at the wrong place, Commander. Our target must have given us a slip. Let's check out the other locations. So I added some LRM5 so I can shoot from far. I got the heavy rifle so I can uh, brawl close. We'll kill this guy too. Okay, let's go. In terms of my Lancemate AI, I think it's improved since I last played. They're still a little bit dumb. But the skills does seem to work a little bit better. IFF readings are showing all targets at this location, Commander. There we go. Approach with caution. Okay, let's see what we can do. The heavy rifle has higher range. Ooh, really. Oh no, that was a mistake. Okay, so let's find uh, this valley over here. I gotta remember the right weapons. Heavy rifle one. The problem with the uh, champion mech is that it has a big body, so my torsos are going to get hit often. And my arms are very big too. Nope, I can't see. Torso turn a bit. Come on! Oh, my, my uh, heavy... Heavy rifle takes forever to re to reload. Uh, to reload. And as you can see, I'm not very heat efficient. I might take out the LRMs after this, 
And, uh, oops, careful, Gotham. I'm gonna take out the LRMs and put, uh, oops. Oh, that was a mistake, too. I'm gonna have internal, internal damage now. Okay. Oh my god. That's a bad build. Bad build, Jonathan. Okay. Let's cool down a little bit first. That was one of my teammates. Jeez. Look how slow my my dissipates. It's very bad. That's a Wolverine with a leg. Only one leg. If I can leg it, there should be a higher chance of getting loot. Or a, it a salvage. Let's see, I need to get the left leg. Okay. There you go. You're dead. Okay, let's see if I can get this guy. Landsmates are absolutely useless. Thank God we're going against Griffins and Wolverines, which don't have a lot of health. And what's wrong with you? Oh wait, that's my enemy. That whole time I was still reloading my heavy rifle. So maybe heavy rifle, it might be lighter, does a lot of damage, but you're not shooting it very often at all. The light rifle was much better uh, because because you could snipe you could snipe with it. Okay, let's see. I'm probably going to switch to my Dervish now that I realize it has, uh, what's it called? It has uh, a lot of missile slots and can be played like a uh, Kintaro. I'm not going to waste my shot through the, the woods because I feel like the, uh, the trees block a lot. Okay, so this guy's basically useless. He can't shoot his LRMs in, in close range. My heat is okay. There we go. And I think I'm gonna just leave. That was kind of embarrassing. That was an embarrassing fight. Once again, it's the first time I've played with this champion. So now I know how it how it works. And there's a dropship right on top of us. Form on me, please. Jeez. What is it? A uh, javelin and an assassin. Okay. Ooh, I shot him in the head. He did not like that. No, I should. I, I, I gotta be very precise with my shots. Okay, have your rifles ready to shoot. Okay, I shot him, but that wasn't enough. Where's that last enemy? Where'd he go? Did he die? Oh no. He's trying to fight the dropship. Okay. Good luck with that. Oh, what's wrong with you? Okay. No legs for you. Okay, let's get this guy. Yeah, see? So the uh, dropship is shooting. Uh, it, it, it has large lasers and it has uh, missiles as well. I don't know why it's shooting it though. It's better for us. It's better for me though. If I step in that area though, the, the, the mission will be done. So I'll stay out of it. He has only a left leg. Oh no. Yep, I'm definitely taking the LRMs out. Uh, less flexibility, but I, uh, I shut down obviously way too much. Kind of wish there was more information in the middle of the screen than having to rely on the bottom left and bottom right. 
Okay, so we got sea builds, reputation, medium laser, another heavy rifle, which I kind of don't like. Oh, and if we had, if we took all the salvage shares, then we would have been able to get an assassin, which is a very nice mech in terms of speed. It's very fast, but it has very little armament. So that one has two, looks like two small missile spots and one energy spot, which is really horrible. Can't do anything with that. Like you can put two SRM4s and a medium laser, but that's nothing. So let's see what will I get instead. Uh, SRM6, AC, and an AC, uh, let's see how many, I have 20 AC5s. I think I'm okay. I took a lot of damage too, 200. Who took too much damage? It was you. You took the damage. The Griffin or the Phoenix Hawk. I personally don't like the Phoenix Hawk. The Panthers are okay. Let's see. Okay. So, uh, there's still another contract for Davian, which I still I'll, I'll, I will take it from Davian as long as we're not fighting. As long as they don't have me fight House Liao. Okay. So it is a war zone. Let's see. I can use an alternate setup. Yeah, I'll use my alternate setup. Blackjack and some javelins. So we'll go contract. We will go, uh, let's see. Let me just take a look at the star, star map. New Weston, okay. So you know what? We will, uh, let's see. Actually, you wanna, let's, let's quickly, let's quickly modify some stuff, repair all. Let's see, LRM heavy half. Let's see, how many shots did I, I? I didn't even use a lot of shots. 24, I think 24 shots is tons. Uh, so that will free up room for heat sinks. I, I, I do have two double heat sinks. I don't really want to do that. They're very rare right now. And, uh, <laughs> you know, I, I don't want to lose them. So I can still put a couple more heat sinks. Let's see head and another heat sink if I take away from from the arms which have which hold nothing let's see they do protect there we go okay so there we go so so we should be a, a little bit better in terms of heat management nope uh, heat management there we go okay we'll heal we'll repair these guys and this guy I have to I have to replace Let's quickly look at it. We will repair all and we'll replace that. That's what typically happens when you have mechs with uh, weapons on both arms that one of the arms is bound to get blown off rather than torsos. Torsos don't, I feel, get blown off as, as quickly. There you go. And you're ready. Okay. And let's do the next contract for Davian. It's a war, war zone. Difficulty 18. I've, I've been used to about 14, 15, so it's a little bit higher. Let's see. Only two salvage shares. That's not good enough. I'll take that and this. Not getting paid enough. So I'm going to go with my blackjack. I before had a double light rifle uh, class 4 tier four rifles, uh, which I got from, I believe, completing those cantina jobs, but one of them did get destroyed. Um, and uh, I don't feel, I like, I had one that was good and one one that wasn't good and they had different reload speeds and, and that, that did not work very well. So I just switched it up. Uh, we're using chemical lasers, short burst lasers and machine guns. So it's a close, and we, we had enough room to do jump jets, although, I don't know why I don't have more heat sinks. Let me just take a quick look. No, not like I can change it now that I've accepted it. Oh, I, I have tons of heat sinks, that's why. <laughs> okay, let's go back to the mission. Quickly, let's change. So we'll do a javelin. We'll do SRM javelin and war zone. Do we want this guy or another javelin? I always forget the fire starter actually ha is heavier tonnage than a javelin. So I'll do that. I could do a crab as 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 my backup guy. 
I'm always afraid of letting my lance mates uh, uh, use like good or heavier mechs because they're just gonna lose their arms and I have to have uh, expensive repairs. The thing is about the crab is that all the a lot of the armor or the weapons are on the arms, which I which I personally don't typically like. It also has a very long body, so the torso is going to be getting hit often. But if you do stick around, our employers are offering a competitive combat bonus if we can continue to hold off enemy forces past our negotiated timetable. Okay. Doesn't look like we got any allies for this one, which is fine. It's not a defense mission, although I have figured out a way around that. You just basically, you uh, put your lance mates on like three corners and then you take care of the last corner and just uh, move and help help them but you you tell like um, your first lance mate go to one place stay there okay so we're here let me just get to the checkpoint stay sharp met warriors ally Let's command see if this report enemy movement is projected to hurt. hit your location at any moment there are Time some explosives on the ground usually they're red and uh, when you run over them it does hurt your mech I feel like when you go through buildings like this, it should not hurt your neck at all. Or if it does, it's so minimal. Oh, there's something. Okay, so let's see. I think that's my, what was that? My, that's, that's what the cam laser looks like. It's a white beam. Bad news, Commander. More hostiles inbound on your position. Get ready for some company. Ahead. Here we go, lots more. Despite having to kill 16 targets, like most of it is still uh, vehicles, which I like. There we go, an achievement. Target neutralized. That was that. Skull so up with additional bogus commander. Okay, here's a Jenner. We're on it, Commander. I think out of range. Can't get away, you should be running away fast. Yep, you're dead. Who's shooting me? I can hear like an AC. Yep, yeah, AC5, right over there. Need to kill that guy. He likes to hit my arms. Oh, what are you doing? Ah, oh, you're dead. <laughs> LRM10. 400 meters away. That's not enough. There we go. Let's get this AC5 tank. Ah, damn it, I'm so slow. That's the thing about the blackjack, it's just slow. Enemy forces continuing to come back. guy's dead too, aren't you? Just by the time I get you. Yep, he's dead. Okay, five more guys to kill, probably three more. Three more mechs and uh, oh shite, Vulcan and a Shadowhawk. Uh oh, Shadowhawk has an AC5, so we gotta be careful. We're also in what's over there. We have a Jenner. Who cares about the Jenner? And my allies are going after that. Just gonna torso turn, kind of protect myself. Thing is, with the Vulcan, it is like a skinny Kintaro. So we need to take them out quickly. Dead yet? There we go. Okay, you're dead. The Shadow Hawk should have everything in its left torso. So that's what we're aiming for. Come 
on. Come on. There we go. The uh, left torso is out. AC5 is gone, along with a couple different armaments. There we go. He's dead. So, like I've said, apparently, if you leg the mechs versus like coring them, there's a higher chance of salvaging. But although we did get some nice mechs that appeared today, uh, we didn't have enough negotiation points. Was it right leg? So let's see whether the uh, Jenner is going to be available. Come on, guys. How's my teammates doing? That's the last target. And uh, I think we might stay a bit because uh, I'm not too damaged and my teammates are not very damaged either. Okay, let's see. So we'll stay near the uh, exit point. There we go. Got some flyers. That should be easy for my guys. Nope. There we go. What do we got? Spider and a fire starter. Easy. So we'll get a little closer. Maybe use these hills as advantage since I'm a blackjack. Although. Enemy contact. Shame it's a meg. Pretty far away. I tell them to go here because they're a little bit too far ahead. Dango eliminated. I might have just been in position. How's my crab doing? Yeah, Crab has taken a bit of damage on the left side. Relocated and scanning for oh, here we go. Okay. Coordinated attack target received. Is he gonna run away? Right leg is weak. There you go. Right leg is gone. So that should hamper him. Let's get the right leg now. Or left leg. Good kill, yeah, Commander. Dead. Too bad it's going critical. Uh, okay, I don't have time for this. Let's go. Oh, there's something. Okay, good. Our window for extraction is closing. Let's get out of here. Okay, some more sea bells, some more reputation, and anyways, uh, three. I'll take the little, that and this, I guess. Okay, so we only got plus two. They're minus eight. Took fifty-three thousand in damage. I did the most damage, of course way more damage than all three combined they did take at least a little only a little bit of damage which is good at least that's because i'm brawling and they're like staying farther away so that's that mission completed uh there is a high is it is it only okay so let's repair our mechs okay and we will jump to this, uh, what's it called? High, high risk, high reward quest. It's a defense one. So you kind of want a mech that's kind of faster. Would be great to have my dervish at this point. I think the dervish is actually ready, but 
I I didn't make him correct. Yeah, I did not make this guy correct. So let me take away his LRMs. And let's give him SRMs. Sixes. How many do I have? I have five. Oh, I have a lot. There we go. Take away the L take that away. Oh, those are medium slots too? Oh, that's fantastic. Okay, yeah. So basically the Dervish is, is a Kintaro that I can get. <laughs> so let's see, I only have, oh wait, medium lasers. Let's see. The question is where you put the SRMs or the SRM ammo. Let's see, so now that would be 640 shots between 12, Plus, so 20 shots, 640 divide by 20 is 30 some, some 30, 32 shots, I think. So that's not bad. 32 shots plus lasers. I still have room. So maybe I can do a double engine heat sink in there. A single engine heat sink. One more SRM so that we don't have to worry. We'll do that. No, no, uh, what's it called? No jump jets needed for my guy. Okay. So let's do the weapon groups. Mm. Okay, perfect. So, you know what? I'm actually going to, oh, 30 days to refit it. Holy crap. So long. So let's do this contract. Okay, so the contract's ready. So this quest is the first Kittery borderers are conducting raids to target the Cerberus hounds, loyal compelling citizens descended from Davian defectors. You will ensure the hounds safety by any means necessary. Okay, so because they love us, we have a ton of negotiation points. So if I put eight points into it, I could have 33 salvage shares, which is insane. I'm only gonna take one, one point of uh, damage coverage. Probably won't even need it, but look at this, difficulty is 30, which is kind of crazy. That's, the, that's really high. That's twice as, twice as hard as uh, anything I've, I've come across yet. And it is defense, which is worse. Mind the weather, Commander. It'll compromise your visibility. Okay, so I'm going to pilot the Dervish, which I just changed up. And uh, I can have up to 200 tons. So it's time to use the heavier guys. Um, the question is, should I let my my landsmates drive my, my better mechs? Hmm. I don't know. Phoenix Hawk? There we go. Okay. So let's see. Let's let's make sure this is right. This is right. Yeah. Uh, that's okay. Okay. So we have Dervish, Blackjack, which which same win one that I used before. So he's a brawler. I'm a brawler. He's kind of like a, a skirmisher, and he is a kind of like a long range guy, kind of. Okay. So we're ready. So, two skirmisher, uh, two close right. range, one a little farther. I'm dropping you into a region that's set to be targeted by the first Kittery borderers. They're expected to conduct a raid on Kaplan territory on orders from House Davion. Looks mm -hmm. like they're not too happy about the Cerberus Hound's existence. Get ready to gear up and fend off the incoming attack. Okay, so I want. F4 to go here. Looks like we made it here just in time, Commander. Hello, Commander. I have you patched in. Make yourselves at home, but prepare for a fight. We're monitoring hostile activity on our okay. long-range Let me scanners. see if I can go through this street without damaging hostile anything. Just the perimeter, Commander. Your way. Please don't destroy any of my buildings. 
I just hear a lot of things getting destroyed. Damn it. Okay. So F2, go here. F3, go right there. And we gotta start shooting. Something like right above us. One down. Oh. Too late on that guy. Okay, did they get this one? No, they did not. That's AC2. Oh my god. Gotta take out that guy ASAP. Shit, that guy's gonna take out my home. Stop. Let's see, 216. Tangos appear to be bringing in additional reinforcements. There we go. Okay. I'm just hoping no one comes from behind us. I have to support the crab because the crab's by himself. Commander, enemy forces are getting too close for comfort for my people. Chase them down and keep them away from us. Okay, gotta, gotta take out these guys. Okay, that's one. That's two. I'm gonna try to help out the crab over here without destroying too many buildings. It's a spider, it's nothing. But you let him get inside of here and we're in trouble. Stay away. Yeah, that's why. That's why we go missiles. Oh no. I'm not watching my heat. I'm going to come back with internal damage. Okay, watch your heat. Watch your heat. Just chase him a little bit. Just make sure he doesn't get inside the base. There you go. Leg shots. I'm going to leg you. Okay. He lost the leg. He's dead. Okay, it's dead. Enemy forces it's dead. To converge on Another AC5 guy. Our Beautiful. Is on the field. Let's take it down. So still 10 more guys to kill. We have a... Oh. What do we got? Phoenix Hawk. Phoenix Hawk. Okay. Oh, look at all the AC2s on that on that tank. It's crazy. I better help. Phoenix Hawks can get shredded. There we go. We got a Wolverine, a Phoenix Hawk. Okay. What's this? A locust just hiding. Bad shooting. There we go. Okay, so it looks like they're flanking over there. Uh, I want my Phoenix Hawk over there too. And I'll let the, uh, what's it called? The, the Blackjack stay. Yep, they're flanking, definitely flanking. Hey, hey, you're not allowed to go inside. No going inside the... There, one more Alpha Strike of missiles should be okay. Okay. Uh-oh. 
Oh, where'd he go? He's dead. More hostiles entering the combat zone's perimeter. Brace for additional contacts. Ah, uh, let's see. I need my blackjack. Go over here. Let's help out. Nice reveal to your back. gonna go destroy these things they can finish off the Wolverine although I see three mechs holy moly I need some longer range come on go faster oh I meant didn't get it fully Oh, stupid trees. I hate trees so much. There's that guy's dead. That's down. That's down. That's down. Okay. Now it's just, uh, what's it called? Three more, three more targets. At least two mechs. What do I have? Panther and a Shadowhawk. Okay. You're trying to leg it so I can get it. Ugh. Stupid. Too fat. Oh, three mechs. What's the third mech? Right in your back. Just hit your right arm. You hit the right arm, that's where the PPC is. Yep, there you go. Hex that. Oh, okay. Uh, either leg. I said get either leg. There we go. Just right leg. Okay. Oh, don't go inside the base. He's dead. What happened to the last guy? Last guy's trying to escape. No leg for you. And I need to get this left leg. There we go. He's dead. And 93% defended. Okay. Lots of sea bills, lots of reputation. We have a Wolverine. So you're telling me that you lose torso and an arm and both legs, and you can salvage that. This one, it got cord and salvage it. That makes sense. And this one lost legs, so I don't know. This tells me that it's random, but this tells me that the more pieces that you leave for salvage, the better, uh, the the higher chance that you'll get a mech to salvage, but this, this tells you the exact opposite. So let's see, can we get both? We can get the Wolverine and the Spider. We can get two. Oh, let's see, the Wolverine has Let's see, a ballistic slot. Looks like a, a meat, a small, small, it's, it's average. Let's see, any other gear that's maybe worth it? No, no gear that's worth it. So we got two mechs from that. Oh, two mechs from that mission. I love that. Total pay, we got good pay, defended, and we only took 186. Beautiful. I obviously did the most damage. They took quite a bit of damage because because they're fighting by themselves. And me. Okay. Here we go. And as you can see, we completed this this quest over here, uh, our job, kill four Panther mechs. So by doing that, we got more sea bills. That's quite a hefty amount more reputation. We got uh, three machine guns, machine gun ammo, reputation with the bandit clan, and career reputation. And that leveled up our mech hunter uh, area. And that means we got this. Faster projectiles one. So mech hunter. So this thing basically. 7.5% sp 
range and velocity. That's not bad at all. Okay. I want something for missiles though. Uh, let's see, turn speed, energy cooldown, ballistic. I don't think that counts as ballistic. Missile, missile damage, ooh, 5% more. Range and velocity, I'll probably equip that onto my dervish. I think dervish will be my, 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 my main thing now. Looks like there's a transmission. You have protected our loyal citizens thus far, but the fight against our great enemy is far from over. The Davianists will not stop until they are either victorious or utterly destroyed. See to it that you ensure the latter, not the former. Continue to aid us in the fight against our oppressors and you shall be rewarded. While you held off the first Kittery borderer's initial assault, the Cerberus hounds have evacuated most of their non-combatants and will be sending your, you reserves shortly. In the meantime, it is recommended that you lure the Davian troops into the Badlands and hold them there as long as possible. You will be provided with maps that should enable you to play an effective game of cat and mouse in order to buy you time needed for the relief force to arrive. Large laser. Okay. Let us repair our mechs first. Let's see. Repair. Repair. Nothing broken, right? Nothing broken. Oh, we got the Wolverine now. Ah, uh, let's see. We will... Might be better to strip the mech. Maximize the armor. So medium ballistic slot. That's not bad. Not bad. Maybe in... Let's see. We have about 17, 17 tons of space. Uh, I think we're going to do an AC-5. AC5 SRM6 and a medium laser in the head we will give you a heatsink and we'll give you some ammo for both let's see we'll put the SRM ammo with your SRM and your AC5 ammo over here. That'll give you 80 rounds. This will give you uh, 320, way too much, more than you need at all. We're already at full armor. So I guess I'll give you, uh, let's see, should I give you, I can give you jump jets. There we go. Jump jets, great. Okay, there we go. Can I also give you an upgrade while you're doing that? I think we can. So let's see, ballistic range, missile damage. We'll drag there. And we'll do missile range and velocity. There we go. Uh, heat dissipation, we were okay. Uh, let's see, jump jets, sensor range. That might be good. Okay. Sensor range 880. That's not amazing. And it looks like you can take it out at any time, possibly. We'll start work. Take seven days. Let's uh, view the star map. Let's see. What quests do we have here? House Merrick and Independence want us to fight House Davian. So I can do that. So let's head that way. But I think we're going to end the video right there. Uh, thank you very much for joining me today. Check out the rest of my channel for other videos on MechWarrior 5, video games, board games, and other fun things. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.